Salutations, my name is Kudoso and welcome back to the RimWorld colony of Cardonia. Last episode we had this group of travelers coming in. Uh, Key is Rob's son apparently. Also starting to prepare this uh, room for dining. Uh, in the future I can expand it by adding another set of tables and chairs over here. So that's great, we have uh, added a fridge over here. And uh, we are slowly starting to build a new bedroom. How much wood do we have? We have plenty of wood. Which makes me happy. Um, what was I looking for again? Right. Floor. Uh, probably also should add a door. Probably. I think I am going to start walling stuff off, actually, and just expand as I go. So, the exterior wall. The uh, downside is, if I could do that, but I'm probably going to expand this way. So I'm going to make that wall out of wood, because stone walls are a pain to... Um, Deconstruct. So in one of those airlocks again. Oh, and I should also add a vent. There we go. Now start building and hauling and whatnot. How many people do I have in construction? Actually, everyone. So you seem like you're broken, but you appear to be working? Oh, weird. Producing more than enough power, strangely enough, considering all the coolers. And the visitors is leaving. We have not captured uh, poor key. Uh, might this become an exterior wall? We want to expand. I probably want to expand this. Poor mood, of course. We have low medicine. Yes, I am aware. New lovers. Wait, what? Guido and Wendy have come together and are now lovers. You sly dog, you. Congratulations, I suppose. Right. Huh. Cool. Funny. And all that kind of jazz. So where am I going to put the airlock? I'll just put it in here. Again, just building it out of wood because it's temporary. And wood is easy to, to, to break down again. So I'm going to probably have to chop a bit more as well. How far are you along? No, not too far at all. Oh, you've probably already been cut once. Nice. So now those two are lovers, I should probably give them a double bet. We have like five people in... Yeah, we can do that. Um, quality poor, poor. Traders. Nice. I'm going to reinstall. Yeah, the beds would be more efficient if they were... Right here, but I don't like the look of it. Power. Um, you are at 20 degrees. Yeah, you, that's a bit much. 25 isn't enough. And as soon as this one has been... Can you do that? No? That one. Yeah. Please do. And we're going to add a double bed. For the lucky couple. Yeah, I'm going to put it in the corner. Why not? 
Uh, Rup, what are you doing? Holding... Yeah, I kind of want you to uh, prioritize on that. Uh, okay, you don't want any of the lovers. Great, cute. And, alright, so who is my best warden? You are six, you are seven. You have a 3.5 trade improvement. And the other one was... Rob. You have a... 3. Okay. Hido it is, I suppose. It was Hido, right? Yeah. I want you to trade. Who knows? They might actually buy my human meat. Uh, they do not. Pity. They can do sell medicine, but at a very high price. Uh, I'm not going to use short bows. Ever. A poor pistol. How much damage do you do? Nine. Nine, 34. So what's the difference? Accuracy. Oh, wow. Those are really bad at shooting stuff. Yeah, and the gray bow. So not the greatest. You could buy a shotgun, but don't feel much for buying shotguns. You do not have any components, which is saddening to me. Oh, we have apparently another alpaca. Cool. We could sell them, but I don't want to. I don't need huskies for anything. Apart from that, there is really nothing they have that I want. Well, want and can afford. So we have another Rebecca and I completely missed that. Hmm. What are you doing? Harvesting cotton plants. Wow, that one grew. Or oh, is the rest already grown? Yes. Okay. Righto. Who was my best constructor again? Rob, and you're doing what? Yeah, how about you do that? Um. Hello. How about you obey me? What is it with you? There we go, and you can be destroyed. And you... Will be Hiro and Wendy. Well, they have... To be honest, they have spent a lot of time together in a prison cell. So... Yeah, fair enough. If only... Uh, I would have preferred Bejan to get a relation, because... What do I want with a capybara? I mean, really? What can you do? Not much, really. Oh, well, whatever. Where was my colony again? There it is. All those huskies. And I want to train alpaca too. With obedience, because I believe you need obedience in order to harvest their wool. I probably should requires some extra sleeping spots as well. And more sleeping spots. For now, we'll just put them in here. There we go. I really wish they would... Um, yeah. Cooking fine meal. No, I want you to prioritize that. Prioritize that. Yeah, you can train a pocket, sure. Come on, boys, hole. There we go. Right, so this should be a bit more spacious now, as well as this. 
Buffalo, hello. And this area is coming together great. Um, don't even have enough steel for a lamp, that's really sad. And I want a zone. Of importance. Clear all. Now I don't care about food, I care about textiles. You get all the cloth. Uh, and you get all the cloth. And apparently these are separated. Cloth and wool then. No. Yeah, let's keep the cloth and wool. And all the others. And add a little. Forty mm. percent efficiency. Me. Usually not 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 a different material. Uh, there is. Much better. And, of course, a little chair. There we go. This will be the only entrance open to the outside. Until I close it off. Which I'll probably do. Um, stretcher. Marble. Like so. In this storage area, for now it's okay, we'll probably move it in due time. There we go, the entire thing is now roofed. Yeah, this has no cooling. So I should start adding some vents in here. And let's also add a vent in there. That takes so much steel. Not cool guys, not cool. Cargo pods. Marble blocks. I have, I have plenty. Oh, look, Jade. Machining parts. It's a long way up there. Oh, look, someone is mining. Great. That's helpful. Yeah, I should probably cut some more wood again. Last thing I wanted to run out of wood. And I need to keep an eye out on my batteries. Probably should add a, just one more, just a case, but I don't really want to spend some steel and components on it. There might still be a lot of minerals in here, actually. Hmm. Who knows what's inside of that? It's not steel, or marble. Wasn't like any warning of agent danger. If there is, I am so much screwed. No, nah, just a ball. Strange. Mysterious. Add a little bit of light. Here and there. The cleaning really needs to be done. Doesn't seem to be that much hauling going on right now. So. Eclipse! Ah, uh, well. Too bad, because I don't use any solar power. Which is a first. 
But it works for me. Alright, so... Uh, this is always tricky because I don't really know what I want to wear. There's so many things. Well, we're going to make pants, of course. I want two pants. No, that's a bit much. Sure. Only look at like 80 or more. I think. No, that's different. Um, alright. So you now have one, and if I would st say, you know, only look at like that percentage. No, that percentage. Which you then say, no, it's the materials they're looking at, not the uh, product. Very well. Um, T-shirt. Um, duster. A architect named Susumu Jensen calls you from nearby. He's being chased by tribespeople from Tona of Hedgehog. He begs for safety and offers to join your colony. Biologically, is 33 years old. An architect. Uh, someone who can build. Um. No thanks, actually. Okay, uh, probably want some jackets. Yeah, uh, sure, let's add some cowboy hats, why not? There we go. This way we won't have to strip people anymore because the clothing that comes off of that is really bad. And you cannot uh, destroy stuff to get their materials, so... Eh. Uh, you have no power. Or light. Uh, you're going to bed, chum. You are always on the brink of being sad. There we go. I should also build some plant pots. Pots. There we go. Slate. Oh, there's no wind. That's bad. Ah, oh, the wind is picking up. Good, good, good. Do we have any animals that I am unaware of? No. Well, you look, you are... You are now obedient. Good job. You probably are not. No. And I don't necessarily want killer alpaca, so... I'm not going to train them for release. That would be silly. I want them for the wool. I should probably also build the floor there. Um, yeah, shit. Sure. Let's be fancy. Oh, let's be even more fancy. I believe they like slate more than they like. Yeah. Wood is neutral. Slate is plus two. Oh, they really do not like the look of leather. Wow. Like they hate it. 
For vengeance? That's kind of weird, actually. So yeah, I might just wall these off after all. Like so, escape pod. I'll look at you in a moment. Add a door. <laughs> All right. Who are you? What do you want? You don't have any interaction with the rest of this group. You are incapable of violence. You're hypersensitive, slowpoke, and you are nervous. Do you have anything good on you? Um. Robert, you should probably rescue him regardless. I will just release him. I don't want him in my colony. I need people who can fight. Ah, uh, yes, and you can stay open. That way, this is still two rooms, I believe. Once, you know, the wall's actually finished. Yeah, it's two rooms. Temperature is just fine. And look at that, the beauty is actually positive now instead of the negative. I am so smart. Sometimes. So also basically means yeah, we could also keep this open but eh, this will equalize the temperature. How hot is it outside? Eh, a bit. Oh look! <laughs> what? <laughs> Rob has named Alpaca to Mini after being nuzzled. I... I... Don't, don't even... No, just... No, I don't even... Right, well, um, apparently they can get names. I didn't even know that. So, this is going on... Who is actually going to craft tailoring? Oh, Bedjan, of course you are. You're a six, you're a four, you're a nine. Uh, I'm going to up you so I can up you as well. And the rest can stay as it is. So after cooking and crafting, it will prefer smithing or tailoring above construction. Well, we have plenty of people who can build, so... We'll keep it at that. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you all very much for watching. And I do hope to see you again next time.